got an old TP-Link Archer C20 router, and want to use it to extend your wired internet and create a new Wi-Fi access point? You're in the right place. Setting it up in access point mode is a fantastic way to boost your coverage using a device you already own. Let's get started. What is access point mode? First, what are we doing? In access point mode, the Archer C20 stops acting like a router. No firewall, no DHCP server. It simply takes a wired internet connection from your main network and converts it into a wireless signal. It's a wired to wireless bridge and it's incredibly stable. Step one, physical connection. Step one is all about the physical setup. For this, you will not use the blue internet port on the Archer C20. Take an ethernet cable and plug one end into any one of the yellow LAN ports on your main router. Plug the other end of that cable into any yellow LAN port on your Archer C20. Finally, plug the Archer C20 into power. Step two, access the Archer C20 settings. Connect your PC or laptop from C20 router ethernet port or using Wi-Fi. Open a web browser. In the address bar, type the default IP address 192.168.0.1 for the Archer C20. For first time login, create login password and press start button. Once you're logged into the dashboard, look on the left hand menu for network and then click on land. Inside the LAN settings, the most important step is to change the IP address of the Archer C20 to avoid an IP conflict with your main router. If your main router using different IP address, then you can keep C20 default IP address. Login C20 with new IP address and then go to operation mode from left side menu. Choose operation mode access point and press save button. The Archer C20 will now reboot and apply the new access point mode settings. After the reboot, log in again Archer C20 router and now follow next steps to set up wireless settings. Step four, configure your Wi-Fi. After the reboot, log in one more time at the new IP address. Now go to wireless settings. Here, you can set up your Wi-Fi. You have two choices. Use the same SSID and password as your main network for seamless roaming. Or create a unique name and press save button. Now go to wireless security settings under wireless 2.4 gigahertz settings and set a strong password and click save. Now go to wireless 5 gigahertz settings and change SSID name and press save button. Now go to wireless security settings under wireless 5 gigahertz settings and set a strong password and click save. Now go to your mobile or laptop Wi-Fi and check for new SSID name. Connect it and test internet should work. Once connected now open browser and access any website. And that's it. Your TP-Link Archer C20 is now a dedicated access point. If you found this video helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe channel to get more videos. Thanks for watching.